Hi everyone! Welcome back to another Period Drama Monday! The period drama I would like to talk to you about today is Under the Greenwood Tree. And this was made in 2005, and it is just an hour and 40 minutes. So as far as period drama goes, it's very, very short. And this is uh, based on the very short novel by Thomas Hardy. It's the only Thomas Hardy that I have read. And I'll say I actually like the period drama a lot more, which I don't usually say, but I do. And I like it because it's just very lighthearted. It's very fun and lively, but it's also calming in the way that all period dramas are. And this is about Fancy Day, which is a great name. And she moves to a small town and then basically has lots of men vying for her attentions and kind of, she has to decide who she wants to be with. Um, it's, yeah, like I said, it's just very lighthearted. There's maybe not as much emotional depth as you would get in the longer period drama, but when you want something light and fun, I think this is a good one to go with. And like I said, the main character's name is Fancy Day, and there's a character in there named Dick Dewey. There are just some great names in here. And also, I just love the very small town feel of it. There's lots of drama when uh, the vicar of the town, of the church in the town, wants to bring a pipe organ, and he wants Fancy to play the pipe organ. And so there's lots of speculation and how will this change everything and so it very much has the feel of Cranford you know kind of like middle class Victorian England small town and uh yes it's just very very fun although I say middle class there wasn't really too much of a middle class then but some of the characters I'd say if there was a middle class teachers the vicar um those people would be be middle class and then most of the characters though are working class but it's just very fun and there's some humor in there, and Fancy is a lot more likable in this one. And it's just a story of her choosing who she wants to be with. So if you have an hour and 40 minutes to spare, I definitely recommend this uh, Victorian period drama. So I hope you guys are enjoying Victober and you're having success with everything that you're reading. And if you want a break from the reading, I recommend you check this out. And it is on YouTube, so I will link it down below. And you can watch that at your leisure. I will see you guys for another video soon.